near-death experience or NDs have raised a wide interest in general population around the world. Based on it, we decided to investigate the mainstream scientific literature on near-death experience. Our purpose was to, to see the profile of mainstream scientific papers published on near-death experience. To perform this investigation, we searched for articles about near-death experience in one of the most important scientific databases, Web of Science. The term near-death experience was coined by Raymond Mood Jr., a psychiatrist in the United States, in a book called Life After Life in 1975. In our investigation, we identified 266 scientific papers published in mainstream scientific journals. The first was published in 1977. Most of the papers published were not based on original data. They were basically opinion articles, review papers, letters, comments, editorials. And also most of papers were published by authors from the United States. However, since 2000, we have had uh, improvement in quality of papers, more original data in good longitudinal or cross-sectional studies. We have found more discussions about the implications of near-death experience to mind-brain relationship. And also, we have found a broader geographical diversity of studies. Studies not only from North America and Western Europe, but also some studies from Asia and from Latin America, for example. Basically, in conclusion, we can see that the scientific literature on near-death experience are very recent, few decades. Most of these papers are not based on, based on original data. Although, in the recent years, in the last decade, one or two decades, uh, more original data based on cross-sectional and longitudinal studies have been published. And some guidelines for future investigations on near-death experiences would be First, to increase the cultural diversity of places where these investigations on NDs have been performed. It will be very important to compare the characteristics of NDEs in diverse cultural and religious backgrounds. So studies testing explanatory hypotheses in high-level original data. This would be very important. So near-death experiences uh, will continue very probably to be a very challenging and interesting area for our investigation that will probably help us a lot to understand better the relationship between mind and brain and in some sense help us understand the human nature.